What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. <laughs> As you guys see the title today guys, I know you guys been waiting for it. Uh, we've just been so busy guys. So here is our new house tour guys. We're super excited. We're not done yet, but I feel like we owe it to you guys because I feel like we haven't really posted because we're like, okay, wait, no, we, we should wait for the video. Hope you guys like this video, guys. If you guys are new to this channel, guys, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Make sure you turn on that notification bell so you guys can get alerted every time we post up a new video. And make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up, guys. Yeah, today's a little cloudy because it just finished raining. So the lighting might be a little off, but um, this is the best time that we could do it. The kids are in school. All right, so we are walking in. So for the entrance, we are not done, obviously. I have envisioned um, a really big black mirror um, and then a carpet, probably like uh, mm, like a darkish, not, maybe not black, but on those um, terms. So then we come down this way and we have our storage room that has a couple of like i said guys we just yeah. literally were i would say what 80 percent moved in with stuff yeah about 80 85 percent so yeah we're just throwing stuff in there just like yeah but obviously this is going to be cleared out because i do want to make this like the kids playroom this is the only yeah. area they're going to have other than outside <laughs> um yeah so then again right here i want to say probably more family pictures um and then we have upstairs but we'll save that this is our first picture here at the house and then over here guys this is literally like a it's called a mother-in-law suite which we will show you right now liked it um obviously right now it is occupied so we don't want to invade privacy um but to continue with the house um this i've actually been working at super hard because i feel like this is where we normally are at so originally at the penthouse i did want white furniture but everybody thought it was crazy which i'm kind of glad we did it because i feel like now that we're more calmer and we're more like like situated and stuff um, I feel like I'm so happy that I went with my white couches. I finally got them. So these are the cloud couches. Um, super comfy. Um, and then I ended up adding these two accent pieces. And they're actually really cool. They like recline and they're rocking. We bought these before we saw the couches. But I already knew that I wanted couches. Again, this is from the Alley House. And so are the statues. Yeah, so we're pretty much working with what we have. And then uh, we, I just ended up installing the courage, which I'm in love. I feel like it makes it look very magical, very, I don't know. I just love it. Um, this is what I had envisioned for this house. Mm -hmm. um, and then we have our dining area, which I am not done yet. Obviously, you guys can see. I wanted a whole wall of mirrors, or these, doesn't matter. Uh, I'm going to try it out with these, and if I like it, we're going to keep it. If not, I do want to make my own wall of mirror so i'm very inspired guys tiktok thank you <laughs> okay and then i do want to buy a rug here for under um the dining area this is from the alley house which i love you know i all the pieces that i do buy i feel like i put so much hard work and so much effort into finding them that i feel like it's always like good to i don't know for me i feel like it's like sentimental value that i can honestly use them wherever i go for as many years as I can. And then the backyard. The backyard is under construction, guys. Yeah, so the um, backyard is under construction, guys. So they just pour cement, guys, as you guys can see. And then all that's gonna be uh, synthetic grass. And then there's gonna be like planters there. And then uh, like trees yeah, all around. Yeah, I'm thinking about doing a garden, guys. And then um, we do want to obviously fix it up for the kids because I feel like... Put a little playground for yeah, them. Yeah, my kids just, they love being outside. <laughs> and then obviously here's my working area. I'm still not done. I do plan to put more ceiling curtains here. Um, ceiling curtains here. Uh, maybe add a little bit more decoration because obviously you can never go wrong with too much decoration. Um, this is Pablo's area. This is memories of... Here's yeah, so <laughs> all these bottles, guys, um, are empty. All of them. They're all empty. Um, so, yeah, I'm like five, going to six months sober. Um, 
But uh, the only reason why I kept them, guys, is because at night, I don't know if you guys can see, like these little strings are coming off, but those are LED lights. We have them um, all on the top, all in the bottom, under that bar, and under here. So at night, it glows up. But yeah, all these bottles have a meaning. Um, that's why I saved them. They are expensive bottles also, guys. Yeah, and this is Steph's mess. I'm working on orders, guys. If you guys haven't checked out our um, website of our merch, um, you guys can get a little sneak peek. Those are hats that we sell. We got all different Mexico State hats. Um, but yeah, guys, go check that out. I'm gonna leave the info in the description down below. Okay, <laughs> so Kitchen Area, obviously I'm not done because I have to, yeah, it's just crazy. Um, so yeah, I'm not done. So as you can see, it's very minimal. I love it, very clean. Uh, I'm trying to get super organized, guys. Um, yeah, I guess that's it. Um, I will show you guys in my TikToks when I do get organized. But honestly, he surprised me. Um, I love that he got it black because we didn't really know the colors that we wanted for the house. Um, but one of the coolest things about this is literally it has a beverage section. And it literally comes with filtered water in the fridge. As a pitcher on yeah, it. Yeah, as a pitcher. And then you can also do your cup, which is honestly so cool. Because I had the Primo water dispenser, but honestly, I'm so glad because I got rid of it. And yeah. Um, I haven't organized my area, but... It also has cameras in there. Yeah, it has cameras. It has a smart tablet. You can watch YouTube and stuff like that. This is a little snack area. I did have it filled up, or like earlier in the week, but yeah, the kids honestly ate so much. And yeah, and then this fridge actually has an ice maker as well. Uh, it came with this and it does make two different types of ice, which is pretty cool. Lots of storage, I love it, it's very aesthetic. Um, it is counter depth, so I really do like it, it doesn't stick out too much. Um, yeah, so then let's move on to my messy and organized pantry that I am planning to <laughs> organize, guys. We'll give you guys a quick look, guys, but... Yeah, we'll give you guys a quick look. Um, it's not too big, but it's actually perfect because I don't want to be, like, hoarding stuff. Um, I want to literally, like, when we were in Mexico, honestly, I love how they do. Like, they literally, whatever they cook, they buy within that day or the day before. Which, honestly, I feel like it's just healthier and, like, de like defrosting and stuff. Like, I don't know. I just want to go more know what i have in my pantry and use it so and then we have the guest restroom which i will be remodeling because i just love making my life complicated so it's pretty simple plain um i feel like i could definitely do a lot here i want to add some wallpaper i want to add some floating shelves i'm glad steph's doing all the talking in the bottom because i'm gonna do all the talking on the top <laughs> And then here is our three car garage. Obviously right now we are trying to separate everything that we do want, what we don't want. And then in here we are gonna have shelves to organize party stuff, storage stuff, boy stuff. Because when I have this baby, I wanna totally be in control of everything and I don't have to be like, oh my goodness, how is it downstairs? What are the boys doing? What is Demi doing? Um, but yeah, here's the belly guys. Um, well, I'm five months, but I feel like it's growing. All right, guys, so this house is two stories. Um, I love two-story houses. I feel like everyone in the family is like, oh, why? Because obviously it's like going up and down. You have to have two sets of everything. I'm up here, I'm up upstairs. But to me, I feel like, honestly, I don't mind it. You know, I feel like for the most part, all of our rooms are upstairs. So I feel like it gives us more privacy since we always do have people over. Um, so I really like it. I really enjoy it, but yeah. Um, so the whole house does have really um, um, light colored uh, carpet, so it is a little difficult, especially with kids, but honestly, we have a no shoes in the house rule, which honestly, I feel like if you really think about it, it makes more sense um, just because we are walking around and stepping on who knows what. So I'm actually really fond of that concept, especially now with the baby, I feel like uh, it's more... Um, germophobic clean 
But yeah, so this area here, I will let Pablo talk. We will be switching. All right, guys. So this is going to be my favorite place of the house. Um, it's not yet. There's a reason to it because it's not finished yet. But behind me, guys, it's the uh, theater room, guys. So you guys can see we have a projector. It's 100 inches, guys. Um, but yeah, this is my projector that Steph gave to me like what, three years ago or so? Three, four years ago? And we're probably using it. I mean, we used it before for like the boxing fights and stuff, but right now we're, um, like I said, this is gonna be the movie theater. So we just gotta buy some couches and maybe here and there some decorations. Um, and that's it. <clears throat> yeah, I was even telling him right here it would be good for that moon chair, the half moon chair. Cause I feel like we're gonna keep it wide and it's like the only place and it would be really nice. Like, it's so cool. Like. Oh yeah, guys. And by the way, if you haven't subscribed yet, Make sure you guys hit the subscribe <laughs> button. All right, this is our channel right here, guys. Um, and if you're new to this uh, in, into this uh, journey with us, uh, make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up, turn on that notification bell so you guys can get alerted every time we post up a new video. Um, and yeah, guys, so now we're coming this way. Um, so this house is a five bedroom, four bath, living room, kitchen, uh, three car garage and a loft um, <clears throat> Now we're coming to my favorite place in the house guys. This is where I like to stay at this most is, of the time <laughs> This is where I keep Pablo out to <laughs> so whenever Steph is getting to her pregnancy moods and you know only, only fellas will understand that I come here to my happy place So sure. watch what's going on right here guys So this right here guys is This right here guys is my office this is my favorite spot of the whole house. Um, I have my shoe collections right here, as you guys can see. All right, all right. Um, but yeah, I got my fours, my J Balvin's, got my Jordans, my Dunks, um, my Air Forces, my Yeezys, um, my, like I said, my Jordans. Yo, shout out to Steph and my son, though, for getting me. Uh, if you know, you know, they got me these for Christmas, guys. Come on, let's go. The they were a mission to find, guys. If you guys were looking yeah. for them for Christmas, yeah, they were so hard to find. Um, and then I got um, most of all these right here on my designer. I have them separate. These are my designer shoes. Uh, Dutch Cabana, um, Versace, uh, Christian Louis Vuitton, Dior's, um, Burberry, um, etc. Gucci. And then, yeah, guys, so as you guys can see, this is my hat collection right here, guys. Um, hey, I keep them out of the room, guys. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> and then this is where um, I come and edit for you guys. Um, so, yeah, this is where I come edit for you guys. Um, this is where he does his lives, where oh, he yeah, does boy where, time. This is where I do my himself. TikTok lives. If you guys <laughs> have not followed me on TikTok, make sure you guys follow me on TikTok. I'm going to leave the info in the description down below. And you guys can hop on my live and uh, we go lit there. We'll be cracking eggs on top of our head. We'll be eating chiles, whatever. It, it, Making whatever. a mess in my house. <laughs> yes, I know. Yeah, so um, for those of you guys, uh, if you guys uh, know, I am an Anuel fan, guys. So I got to shout out uh, my boy Rob, the original. He actually did this for me, guys, uh, with his thumb. So yes, all guys. this is just thumb prints. Literally. All that is just thumb prints, guys. So if you guys need a special, um, if you guys need art a special piece. art piece for a present or a restaurant or your room or etc., whatever it is, this guy just throw him a towel, throw him some pins, throw him pennies, <laughs> throw him anything that's around you guys, and this guy will do it for you guys. And I'm not exaggerating. Yeah, this guy's out of this world. Um, so hit him up. I'm gonna leave his info in the description down below. Also, guys. Um, let them know uh, Pablisi gang sent y'all and then yeah guys uh, he actually did this one too oh he yeah he did this art piece and then um, all this right here is stained like if I touch it like you'll see right there um, all burnt. this was fire yeah, he burnt the canvas he burnt it so it can look like he was turning super saiyan but um but yeah guys um, so is your toys so is your collection <laughs> my, oh my little collection I mean it's just, uh, you know, we got the Thanos hand right there. Hey. You got the, and they, I'm, I'll show you guys a little bit here and there, you know. Oh, Oops. so, so all of these move, guys. All of this moves. Yeah, the stones come off, so it's pretty the cool. Stone. I have no idea where he found it, but, but yeah, when well, you send a man to the mall to buy something, <laughs> that thinks he comes back with. 
Yeah, guys. Um, other than that, guys, let me see what else. What else? Um, yeah, just like a collectible. He has a ring here. When the Dodgers won the World Series. Yeah. Uh, I got the Power Ranger helmet too, guys. I'm going right. to be putting that on on my TikTok lives. <laughs> I got uh, baseball cards. I have the Allen Iverson. Allen Iverson was one of my favorite uh, basketball players. That's so cool. I don't even um, know that. When I grew up, I watched him, him and Kobe. And then I got all my pens here. I got pens for my hats right here, guys. More over there. This is uh, a football by Mark Sanchez, the one they used to play with the Jets and the Broncos. Um, this is uh, a jersey signed by Dwight Howard, guys. Um, when you play with the Lakers. Uh, what else? What else? But yeah, guys, I think I think um, this is enough. This is like a whole mess right now. You guys don't want to see that. Yes. Jay Tufting. Um, Yo, if you guys need any carpets done, yes, hit them up. The off-white. I mean, I'm trying to show your toes. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. Um, but yeah, guys, shout out to Jay Tufting uh, for for the rug right here, guys. Yes, so he can make rugs, anything happen. It's so size beautiful, too, guys. So hit them up. Hit them up. Um, okay, guys. So now we're coming. Uh, we'll come to this side first, and then we'll go that way. Let's do this exactly. Um, this is another bathroom, guys. Yeah, so this Very is spacious. really big and spacious. I'll, I'll, I'll have Steph talk about the bathroom stuff because she's very good at it. I'm really not, but um, I'll switch you spots. Okay. Uh, I'm actually going to be putting like a really sleek table here, putting some decoration, some towels, um, any extra essentials we need, even though I have a lot of space here. Uh, I do want to make it look very um, complete, I guess, because it looks a little empty. Here is the restroom, the toilet. This is a tub for the kids, so yeah. Not much to see here. I will be putting floating shelves, maybe a big base here or something. Yeah. Uh, I haven't really thought about it because I feel like there's other places in the house that I want to get to first, and yeah. All right, guys, so next to my office, um, we got our son's room, Roy. Um, welcome in. He wanted to be just like is that. So this is his room, guys. <laughs> He's next to me. Hey. Uh, when I get kicked out the room, you know, I, I I'm next to Roy. <laughs> yeah. Um, but no, but he, little, yeah, he literally like got stuff. it from Paula. He loves collecting stuff. Like literally, this like the smallest thing. Like this is a small, the world's smallest Rubik's cube, and stuff like that. He's so he has pins right yeah. There. Um, yeah. So he has a collection of hats. Right here, guys. He is the biggest Spider-Man uh, fan, guys. Yes, guys. Another carpet from Jay Tufting. Yes. Let's go. Uh, rug, sorry. Uh, but yes, our son is a bit the biggest Spider-Man um, fan fanatic. Fanatic. So uh, his room is ninety percent done. We just need maybe a couple little things on the walls. Well, we need a TV. We need yeah. a little bit of decoration. I was actually thinking about putting a desk there for his homework. And then obviously it's super spacious, guys. Um, for his birthday, um, I do want to. I plan to buy him something to help him with. He loves doing backflips and just working out. Like, I don't know his little body. So yeah, yeah, guys. So, but this is it here. Nothing crazy, guys. Um, and then we'll go to um, our older son's room. This is our older son's room. Yeah, and again, we aren't done here, but. For yeah. the most part, he is starting his shoe collection just like his dad, so. Yeah, he has more in his closet, but yeah. I'm gonna show you guys that. Um, but yeah, guys, I think he has like the, one of the best views um, like, really? from the house. Notice. He can see like a bunch of mountains left and right. Um, he can see other houses. He can see like the road. I mean, hey. he has a good view, guys. Yeah, then our backyard currently, guys. It's gonna look so nice. I can't wait to show you guys. Mm. And then he has his own bathroom, guys. Um, I'll, sh I'll have Steph show you guys. Yeah, so just, you know, plain, simple toilet, um, a shower. Yeah, so, so that, uh, like I said, nothing crazy. So yeah, guys, so his room is like 75% done. Yeah. Um, as you guys can see, he has- Yeah, so we head. ended up getting the, the hat rack. I think that's what it's called for from Ikea to put all his hats, the mirror. So yeah, obviously yeah. Um, we don't know if we want to change it. Like this is our, this is things we already had. 
so we just pretty much just transfer them so if he wants to change it we'll talk about it but yeah all right guys so we'll switch the camera to steph so she can show you guys demi's room our princess <laughs> all right yes the princess all right so here we go again um these are all things that we had for them so it was just more of putting it in here i don't know if i want to change it or not but for the meantime you know this is what we're working with um until i finish everything else that i need to get done this is her her so loved barbie house she loves it um we have some books there a little table here um her dresser yeah so not much to see obviously um just pretty much keeping it organized you know for the time being and then obviously with time if we decide to change we will but we'll mm -hmm. keep you guys updated um oh one thing that i love about here um i actually coordinated all her bows into colors so like we have the reds the purples the corals the pinks beige and then we have the smaller ones we have the colorful ones and then her little bag collection she has more guys but yeah i'm like Obviously, the cuter ones are on display. <laughs> that is it for this side of the house. Again, we're going to come back to the movie theater room. Well, <laughs> loft that we will be making into a movie theater. And then from here, we have... This was actually the first room that I had finished in the house. I think it's because it was the easiest. Um, we do have the laundry room, guys. So I did... Um, go on TikTok. I was so inspired by TikTok. So yeah, so I ended up doing, you know, like a little cute area and stuff like that. Obviously, they're just for display. They are real like pods and scented beads, but to be refilling them, I feel like a lot of people were like, oh yeah, it was horrible. So yeah, so I was like, yeah, no one's allowed to touch this. It's just literally for decoration. And I literally have, I literally bought stuff to put them in, but yeah, I feel like it's just cuter. And then I have my other ones in the bottom. Um, I ended up putting these because I do have blankets and um, extra linen here and like we have um, inflatable beds and extra pillows for when guests come but yeah again I put the curtain so that it wouldn't just look like a whole bunch of colors are thrown so I really liked it I really like the clean minimal look um, that's exactly what I was going for very light and then my personal favorite room I'm still not done with it but here we go. I would say I'm like 60% done because obviously we still need to get the baby stuff, which we have not, obviously, because we still don't know the gender. So stay tuned for our next video. It will be posted on February 19th for our gender review. But yes, okay, so this is our dresser, our TV. This is where we have all our PJs and stuff like that. Um, I did want to have a little chair and I thought this was so cute for like when we want to be with the baby or just you know be relaxing when i already do the bed no one's allowed to sit ah. <laughs> <laughs> um and as far as curtains what i had envisioned was something similar to downstairs so i'm actually going to be doing the whole wall which i will be posting on tiktok so stay tuned um yeah so i'm super excited for that we have my vanity here um nothing new i've been having it um i'm trying to see if i want to um upgrade but not right now right now it's like i need to focus on getting situated um i have all my mini perfume collections which demi says this is her favorite part of the house um she loves coming over here and testing all of them out um again our color scheme here is very neutral gold silver it's a mix of them um and then this is going to be the baby area here which i'm super excited because i oh this is actually my curtain. This is my working area, guys. But um, for my baby, I actually, we are gonna keep it very neutral, very cute, very light. To go with the theme, um, we are gonna have a crib here. And I do want to have like draping or a canopy, I don't know what you guys call it. But just very like angelic, uh, maybe a baby dresser with the changing table. Um, we still don't know yet or maybe make a little closet area here for the baby and then put like some curtains kind of like how in the laundry room i did mm -hmm. yeah but we don't know i have a lot of and i have a lot of visions but yeah so far this is what we have i hope you guys are enjoying this video we're not done yet but this is what it is so far 
Okay, so here is the restroom, guys. Again, this is things that I already had, so we haven't um, purchased anything because I feel like other than like the couches and stuff. But um, this is what I'm working with, you know. I want to make sure that the things that I do have, um, I want to keep, and if not, I'm going to put I'm putting them aside so that we can get rid of them. But yeah, again. Silver, gold, I love it. Very neutral. Um, we have a bathtub, a shower. Don't mind the uh, water stains I just showered. Mm -hmm. um, we have um, the toilet area here. Um, I do plan on putting floating shelves and decorations and storage and toilet paper. All right, guys, so this is our closet. We ended up doing a DIY. Um, Pablo ended up helping me because I love how he organizes his shoes. I feel like he's, if you're a shoe head, you know how, or a sneaker head, you know how to organize with your shoes. So I definitely asked him for the favor and he ended up helping me. He ended up making these for me, which I'm super happy because I feel like I can be a lot more organized and I can choose it with my outfit with simplicity. Um, we still haven't finished unpacking because I have a couple more belts. Mm -hmm. Um, but yeah, so this is Pablo's area. Yeah, guys, so don't mind. Mine's still unorganized because I had to come help Steph <laughs> organize hers. Yeah, so then obviously mine was a little harder because I wanted to get all the things that didn't fit me. And obviously that aren't going to fit me within the next couple months. But yeah, so this is what we have so far. I have my bags on top. And then Pablo has the luggages on his side. And yes. Oh, and then uh, shout out to Jay Tufting again, guys. He did it again with the wet grass uh, rug. Let's go. So I think this fit perfectly here. So we put it, we ended up putting it right here. Yes. Step actually. Yeah, like it's it. actually so pretty. I love the color green. So I loved it. I was like, yeah, yeah, this could stay here. Oh yeah, guys. So this is Steph's side of the bathroom, and this is my side of the bathroom. Obviously, I don't look like that, guys. But um, but yeah, but and then um, Steph. I don't uh, look like that either anymore. <laughs> Not anymore, like, but not you anymore. used to look like that. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, guys, um, thank you guys for watching, guys. Um, we love you guys. Uh, we're sorry we haven't uploaded for you guys. Yes. We've been so busy just, like, just moving out, organizing. We had, like, a bunch of stuff. But, um, but yeah, guys, we hope you guys like this video. Um, and um, our next video, guys, comment down below what type of videos you guys want to see. Um, I know you guys want to see uh, baby videos and stuff like that, but Seth's belly is barely showing, guys. Hey, so we're just trying to just save. Massaging my tortas. <laughs> <laughs> we're just trying to save um, when when she's actually like able to see it. Um, hey, because right now I feel like we're like, what are, you, what are they doing? Why are they touching her belly? <laughs> so yeah, so obviously we want to save it to when it's more noticeable. But yeah, yeah. and then obviously I'm. I'm officially no longer sick anymore, so I'm so oh, happy. Yeah. Like we're all happy. I feel like there's such a difference. So I feel like I'm getting, you know, my how do I say it? I'm getting the flow back, you know, yeah. to to be more available for videos and content. So I'm super happy, guys. Yes, guys. And then, um, but yeah, other than that, guys, um, stay tuned. Turn on that notification bell, guys, because. We are having our gender reveal, guys. Um, find out what we're going to be having. February 19th is when you guys are going to find out what we're having. What's in here? Uh, February 19th, we're going to post. Um, I'm thinking around 6 p.m., guys, uh, Pacific time, LA time. Um, and we're going to find out two days before that day mm -hmm. on February 17th. Thank you guys for watching. We appreciate the love and support, guys, and uh, we'll see you guys on our next video. Let's go. We've been patient, girl, you know how I've been. More than a friend, yeah, I love you to the end. So we going to the top, cause you know we gon' pop. Man, they ain't like us, cause you know we been hot. So we looking for love, maybe it's us. 